Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I hope that you have been doing well, that you have been enjoying the holiday season. Crazy that by the time this video is up, it's December. Mm, so nice. <laughs> I realized that the last time I did a skincare video was a pretty long time ago. It was a couple of months uh, at least. So I wanted to share with you my updated skincare routine because I introduced some new products to my routine and I am pretty confident in saying that my skin has never looked this nice. I just wanted to talk about my routine today, um, which is why I don't have that much makeup on. I only applied a little bit of concealer because I always have dark circles. I applied a little bit of lip tint as blush, filled in the brows just lightly, curled the lashes, and applied the same lip tint to my lips. So today we are sporting a very much everyday no makeup makeup look. So without further ado, let's talk about my current skincare routine. Some products in here I have been using for years and some I have been using for a couple of months. That is the reason why I'm only mentioning them now. I want to give especially skincare products a fair shot. So we can't just be using a serum one night and then be stating the next day, oh my god, it changed my skin. I'm going to go in order as to how I apply these to my face. I'm going to start with my daytime skincare routine and then I'll just uh, briefly mention what changes at night because not that much changes. My very first product that I use and I have been using for so many years at this point, I have repurchased it so many times, is the Cosarax Advanced Snail Mucin Power Essence. Lightweight product. It feels slightly slimy but not in a bad way. It really sinks into your skin and my boyfriend uses it, another friend of mine uses it. We all enjoyed this so much and what I think is the best about it and I think I've mentioned this before is that we all have different skin types and we all seem to really like it. I would say I have like combination to oily skin, my boyfriend has straight up normal skin and my other friend has I would say combination to dry and we all enjoy it and none of us get any weird bad reaction from it. I am generally a big fan of snail essence mucin it just helps with your skin to regenerate a lot faster so i feel like whenever i have a scar whenever i have popped a pimple i definitely shouldn't have popped my skin heals very quickly and it is because of this product such a nice first step in my routine it's not too much it's not too little but i definitely notice a difference when i don't use it if you have like a tight feeling on the face you will absolutely love this as like a first step and i think everyone can benefit from this i've been using it for the longest time and I'll keep using it, repurchasing it. I think also the price value is amazing. So yeah, now again, I'm not a professional, so my order may be actually wrong. And uh, I notice my skin is fine, so it can't be that bad. <laughs> Next, what I apply is a benzyl peroxide product. And the one I have is called Benzacnine. Benzacnine, <laughs> it's a German brand, so I don't know how to pronounce this for you. In English, it is a 5% benzyl peroxide gel and it is for daily use. I use it in the morning very sparingly. I don't apply this all over my face because I don't have acne all over my face. And as you can tell right now, I don't have any active, deep, painful pimples on my jaw and chin. And I have to say it is a combination of two things. First, it is this. It is benzyl peroxide that helps me so much. When I started to use this, like the box also says that your skin will start to kind of not peel, but my skin felt so rough and it was dry. I had to go through it for at least two weeks and I did and now my skin is so nice and this helps a lot with my pimple. Sometimes when I have only one pimple and I don't want to apply it on my entire jaw area, what I like to do is take a Q-tip, put a little bit of product on the Q-tip and apply directly to the pimple. I enjoy this so much, but the reason I only use this in the morning and not at night, because I use retinol or a retinoid at night and those two just, they don't like each other and your skin won't like that. <laughs> this has helped me so much. And the other reason I also don't have any deep, painful acne anymore is because I have cut dairy out pretty much 
entirely every now and then i still like to eat something with cheese but not to the degree i was eating philadelphia which is like a cream cheese every morning with marmalade like mm, best combination ever but philadelphia was too much dairy for my body and I had constantly new pimples like they one went away the other was right around the corner and once I stopped with Philadelphia my skin cleared up even with the Philadelphia and using this it was helping I was still getting new pimples this helped but what really helped was cutting out dairy and yeah ever since my skin has been looking a lot better now the next step is a new product um, this is one of the two new products that I've been trying out and I am so obsessed I think it is these two products that have changed my skin texture I'm not talking about the fact that I don't have hormonal acne anymore but looking back at pictures from a year ago I had so many little clogged pores I just didn't have the clearest skin texture which is fine we're just human ever since I introduced these two next products my skin texture has improved immensely i am kind of shocked it's by the brand skin 1004 i don't know how to pronounce this <laughs> i don't know but it is the madagascar centella tone brightening capsule looks like this comes in a glass bottle super luxe i got it on yes style and i think this was on sale when i got it for 14 bucks which is not a lot for 100 milliliters and as you can tell it comes with these little white beads they just you know they dissolve don't feel irritating or anything they dissolve almost immediately this product truly helped with brightening and just improving my skin so much you saw where i applied my concealer i didn't apply that much concealer and most of the skin that you're seeing is my bare skin there is no foundation or anything i feel like i look so even my skin it is bright it is even obviously my skin still doesn't look like a filter i'm still just a human there's still going to be texture but i feel like my skin has never looked and felt this good and i will continue to use this it looks like i haven't used that much but that is because you don't need that much this goes such a long way i apply one dot on each cheek and it is so easy to spread all over the face and yeah again it comes with a lot of product you don't need a lot of product so you won't run through this that quickly so again the price and the value of this is so good i highly recommend this from the same brand i got the madagascar centella soothing cream it is the same exact thing it is from the same line of products the reason that i got a new moisturizer is because if you have been on my channel before you know that my all-time favorite face cream or moisturizer was the Clinique Moisture Search 72 hour auto replenishing hydrator I have been using for years on end it took away the tight feeling that I had and then they decided to reformulate that into an 100 hour hydrator it was not even comparable it didn't hydrate as the other one did my skin felt tight i don't have a serum in my skin carotene and my moisturizer sucks <laughs> so i had no hydration basically i did have the Cosrx essence but just the step was not enough for my skin with only that as my hydrating step and no serum and then that very sucky moisturizer my skin was not happy to say the least and i saw this and this was also on sale it comes with 75 milliliters and this moisturizer is soothing it's calming it's hydrating my skin started to feel so hydrated once i incorporated these two products it was truly what my routine was missing my skin just started to improve day by day week by week month by month and this is where we are right now and i'm so so happy and i would totally recommend this combination together i think it is a match made in heaven finally we have to protect our skin from the sun that is where my all-time favorite sunscreen comes in and that is the Misha Essence Sunscreen. I have used this for so many years. Every time I want to go back to something I know that works, that is hydrating, protects. This is the one that I usually go for. My boyfriend and my other friend, we all use it. Again, we all have different skin types and we all 
love it. No reaction, doesn't leave a white cast, smells very fresh, doesn't leave a sticky film, so no white cast, no stickiness, sinks into the skin very quickly, easy to reapply as well, like you can apply it on top of itself without pilling. This is the last thing that I would do in the morning for my daytime skincare routine and I really enjoy it. And for nighttime, the only thing that changes is that the benzoyl peroxide gets substituted by this one. Oh my god, I've used this for so long and this product I mentioned in my very first video, which is the worst quality ever. It is grainy, the editing. Well, I was in the beginning of this, so I didn't know how to do stuff, but this didn't change. This is still the same and it is the Ordinary Green Active Retinoid 2% Emulsion. Retinoid is amazing for reducing fine lines. I initially bought this because of my hormone hormonal acne and because it just really helps with acne and in combination with benzoyl peroxide obviously not used together but one in the evening the other one in the morning and then if you try to cut out dairy I really hope that you'll see a change in your skin very quickly even if it's a pimple every now and then it's better than having very severe acne I enjoy this product so much I have gotten through so many bottles and I keep going back. The benzoyl peroxide gets substituted by that and I leave out the sunscreen, of course. That is where my routine changes day to night. Sometimes I may not use the ampule. If I want to do a quicker routine, I'll just use the Coser X one. If I find that my skin is doing very well that day and I don't have pimples, I'll skip the benzoyl peroxide. I try to listen and look at my skin, see if it's very hydrated, if it needs a little bit more extra hydration and try to look where my skin is at at that moment. And that, you guys, completes today's video. I think this is going to be a long one, but I, you know, I always say that and in the end, it's always the same, like 10 minute mark. I hope that you enjoyed checking out my routine. Everyone's skin is different, so my routine may work or may not work for you. For now, I am happy and pleased with my routine. I'm happy and pleased with my skin and yeah. I'm just very content right now. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to do that. It helps me and my channel out so much. I hope I'll see you in my next one. And until then, please take care of yourself. Bye.